guys, it's Tipsy Red Rooster. Thanks for joining me today. Come on in. We're going to have something, a splash of something delicious. It's a little bit gloomy outside today, so I'm in my kitchen and we're going to make a batch cocktail. So anybody that's not familiar with them, they're excellent for, um, they have them at weddings, uh, specific to the bride or groom. That's quite trendy nowadays. And just for regular house parties, right? When we're getting together, then we're not pouring drinks all night. As soon as your guests arrive, you can hand them a cocktail. They're happy, you're happy. So well, let's get mixing. We have Gordon's Gin. So this is strawberry and raspberry. Brace yourself, you guys. It's a triple mix today. She's a potent one. Then we have some Cote de Rose, roses, and it is a rose. And we have some sparkling wine, Martini Osti, one of my favorites. So let's get mixing. With the gin, you will need one cup. Ready, everybody? I love that sound. <laughs> one cup. Oh, it smells delicious. Of gin into the jug. And you can also put this in one of those jugs with a spout and then your guests can serve them themselves. Very, very easy. Now with the rosé, we're going to do two cups or roughly a cup and a half would even be good into the jug. Let's see, do we got it, do we got it? Yes, ma'am, woo, we got it. And for the fun part, ooh, hold on a second. We need some lemonade. We need, let me see here, four cups. <laughs> one, actually I measured this one. This is four cups right there, guys. Okay, and then some sparkling. Okay. Always turn your sparkling wine bottle or champagne bottle at a 45 degree angle when you're opening it. Makes it way easier. Don't you love that sound? <laughs> I tell you, when I'm retired, I'm going to hear that sound every morning with my orange juice and sparkling wine. That is my lifetime goal, I tell you. So, we're just gonna top this up with some bubbly. Mmm. There we go. Now, a pretty little touch that you can add, and I did this in advance, is ice cubes. So you can put little edible flowers in there and freeze it, boil your water so that it comes out a little bit clear, and then freeze it for a few hours, and then you can drop those in there too. Super fun. And as they melt, they will sink. But just a nice little pretty idea, especially for those bridal showers or springtime, party time type of parties. Okay. <laughs> oh, I should give it a stir, shouldn't it? Yes, there we go. Not too vigorously because you don't want to lose that carbonation. Just be gentle with that. So I got my little coupe glass here and we're going to give it a try. Ah, she's pretty, such a pretty. <sighs> this tastes so good. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. Oh, you guys, you gotta make this. It's almost cotton candy-ish. It is really good and fizzy and fun. Oh my goodness. So there you go, guys. I made this jug for just under $26. Um, you could make two of these jugs for under 35. 
what's holding the price is the bottle of gin, of course. So however much of that you use is going to depend the price or end up being the price. I gotta take another sip of this, it's fantastic. Oh, wow. That is really, really good. So I hope you'll make it, you guys. And stay tuned, we have really cool products coming up. I got a backlog of them in my pantry now. And we even have a few sponsors, sponsored product videos, and we'll give a shout out to them as well. So tune in next week where we want to tip it, sip it, and educate. Thanks, guys. Hey, honey. Are you hooking up with the groomsmen? He is a hot, hot, hot tamale. Ooh, looking good. Are you enjoying the cocktail? Oh, good, good, good. You keep on partying, sister. Take care. Keep dancing out there. Whoop, 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 whoop. Who fell off her chair? What? Mrs. Schubacher, no. Oh my gosh, what is her husband gonna do? His hip is broken and he's out there dancing. Oh my gosh, he's doing the lambada. Look at him go. Woo! I need another drink. Holy crap, a rolly. This is getting crazy, people. I Bartending? No, this is my first time. I've only ever done this once. What are you talking about? I just need one more drink here. Just one more drink and one more drinky. Mm. So good. You gotta make this this batch cough.